Yeah. Well, because we are in such a technological society right now, Jake has been exposed to things that I don't think I ever was until I became an adult. So he does have the iPad and the iPod and all of those handheld games. So for him, technology was very comfortable. Um, when the message for me was introduced and we had the option to do that, we jumped on it um, because he is on the internet and he is checking email and that's something that he sees us doing. So it was really fun to have, you know, his face pop up and he's telling us something and it was all about what his day was like in school. So as we talk about what had happened in our day, although he's sharing it with us verbally, he was able to pull that up and show it to us visually and then elaborate. And because he's such a talker too, you know, that just carried on to what else happened or um, all of the different activities that happen in school. Of course, you can't mention every little thing, but when he saw that, it sparked his memory. And then he wouldn't allow us to delete it. You know, it had to, you know, we had to keep that all the, always on and there watch and watch and it again, again and again and make sure that, you know, he was part of all of the discussion. And then you would catch him going back and watching it himself, you know, because it was cool to see himself on TV too. So in his mind, that was TV. So it was fun. It was, it was a great program that, um, I know I'll miss because it was kind of fun to get the information. Yeah, and, it, <laughs> and it's very innovative in the sense that most children, irrespective of age, when you say, well, what did you do at school today? Your traditional answer is going to be, well, nothing. nothing. <laughs> you know, or, you know, we just, you know, we did a few little things. But this program uh, really kind of prompts them to communicate with the parent. And if the parent is attuned to that, uh, it really develops some great communication skills right. and also makes that it's good for the child's self-esteem as well because it's like, hey, look what I did and I did this and I'm sending this to you from my school and I'm so happy I did this. And all of that is just, just creates such a positive atmosphere. Right. And so it's a, you know, it's a great use of technology for communicating between the school, the child and the parent and, and uh, being only three years old at the time it was right, introduced absolutely. i mean how many three-year-olds are sending themselves emails <laughs> so that was fun <laughs> one of um the uh, well the option had come about and you basically sign up to um, participate in the program and then um, you submit a picture of yourself and the anybody else who may want to receive an email so if it is going to me at work or my dad at his house or grandma down the street or whomever you want to send an email to the child will have that photograph and instead of typing in a name they basically just punch the picture of the person they want to send the email to so in developing whatever they're choosing to video him doing that day. Um, the one he did see at one point was at lunch. There was something happening at lunch and you know, he was very proud to show us that he was eating and he's identified some of his more favorite friends, little girlfriend that he sits at the table with. So to show him and his girlfriend having lunch was amazing to him. So he would send us that email. Now we could all receive that um, or I could just receive it myself. It was totally up to him, whatever he chose to do. And then that email would be sent to me and I would be able to pull it up just like any other email and watch the video. Um, or forward it, save it, which ended up going to the whole family by the time it was all said and done. But yeah, it's just whatever activity was going on and totally up to the teacher as to what activity to record and send. But um, just basically what's going on at school, you know, and he's in pretty much control of what's going on. And he, he knew that it was happening. So he could say, hello, mom, hello, dad. He knew what was going on. So it was very interactive. And then he couldn't wait to get home to see it. So it is fun. Yeah, and I think it's a great opportunity. It's like sending a note home from the teacher to the parent, what the child did. Well, this has taken it to a whole new level. And not only can you see what's going on, but you could also see what the, how the child's perceiving what, what's going on. And so that, that's a good way to share uh, what's going on at school and to visibly see. So you, if you feel as a parent or as a grandparent that you're there participating in the activities that He's highlighting for you via that technology. Right. And, it's, and, and again, as Becky says, he likes to save his, to watch it back. 
So what a great way to review some work that you did or some skills that you may want to enhance. And, uh, you know, they don't know that they're doing that, but I think that's all part of it. So it's a real positive activity. And it does help you see what's happening during the day, too. I didn't always know what the procedure was at lunch. So by watching that, I could see where was he sitting and who was at his table. So it gives me the opportunity as a parent to get a glimpse into what his day's like where I would normally not participate.